All right, legends, welcome back to another episode of Master Fishing. So for today's episode, it's episode seven of the Road to the 10 Kilo Snapper. If you haven't checked out any of the up, other episodes, um, I've made a playlist for them, so check them out. So the idea is, the goal is to catch a 10 kilo snapper lamb-based or 90 centimeters. So I'm just on top of the ledge right now. So I'm doing a bit of rock fishing today. Here you go. So just before I've got here, it's it was pissing down rain. Uh, it's blowing. It's 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 blowing pretty hard. So these are the conditions that you want. So let's go. Let's get into it. Gotta watch out for snakes, yeah? It's like a little cave here. Perfect. Let's put the stuff up here. Let's get into it. There's the bait. Just bilchards. And I got a freshly caught Trevelli. I think this one will do the damage. And I got some Verily. Let's get this in the water ASAP. So this is just fish guts, skin, and bones. Uh, the last time I went fishing and actually had some luck. Let's throw this in there. Ooh, nice and frozen. We're just gonna throw it out about there. Boom. Right. Let's go. with the Trevelli first. So use it as bait. We go really thin strips. And we shall cut this one about there. This is one of my favorite baits guys. Just put it on. Second bait is a good old faithful pilly. So I'm just gonna lob this one. That can be nice and close. The other one can be nice and far. Oh, here comes the rain, 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 go away, come again another day. Oh, got slow. 
land. Wings. Let's see if uh, this bait can grow wings and go into a snapper of mouth. Now the rain's coming. Fish ain't here, so it just means hard, hard work. I'm throwing out a massive bait, but I'm not here to catch small fish, guys. I'm not here to catch a pinky or a feed, I'm here to catch a monster. Let's go. Sean. Oh. Oh. Just snapper. Yeah. Fish on. Good snapper too. Oh. Come on. Yes. Drag a bit, there's rocks everywhere. <sighs> Definitely a snapper. Ah, this is, yes, it's recording. Yes. Come here, baby. Oh. Got serious weight to it. <sighs> Yes, come here, snapper. Oh no, it's tangled in the other line. Let's get down there, we don't want to lose this fish. Yes. Oh, look at that. Oh no, I'm tangled everywhere. It don't matter. Because I've got a nice fish. Oh. caught on my GoPro. Have a look at that. Oh. That is a beautiful fish. Let's get the hook out, bud. Oh, yes. Now we got it just somehow. Oh, that was a mad fight. Leave this right here for now. Fish. Let's uh, get a good view of the fish. It's so windy, the camera's not even staying. Thank you. 
beautiful. Not one scale on that. All right, guys, that was a pretty good session. I landed one, I dropped a couple, and for some reason, I kept losing hooks. So I'm not too sure if I was getting sharked or if I wasn't tying the knots properly or the line was like, I'm not 100% sure what happened. But I've just measured that fish. It was about 65 centimeters. So, 65, 75, 85, 25 centimeters off. So it's not too bad. I'm getting there. Uh, each episode, the fish are getting bigger. It is snapper season now, and it's been a really, really good snapper season. So a lot of people have been catching big fish. I think I dropped a really, really big one earlier. I'm not sure if I got the footage. If I do, I'll put it in the video. All right, guys, so I've just got home. Um, it was a good sesh. I'm gonna, I didn't fill at the snapper. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cook it whole. I'm gonna keep it nice and simple, and I'm gonna show you guys how I do it and how long it goes in the oven and all that kind of stuff. So. We'll start off with a few ingredients first. So we just get our garlic. We're gonna just chop just a thin slices. Now we're gonna just cut our onion. Good slices. All right, so we got our, that's our main ingredients that we need, rosemary and thyme, onion, garlic. I'll show you what I'm gonna do with the garlic and, as well. And, and lemon. Le and lemon, yes. And mama, And papa, salt and pepper. Lemon, lemon is very beet. Yeah, do you wanna let E try lemon? Yeah. Okay. Try lemon. Sour. Sour, oh. Tasty too. I'll taste it too. Mm. Delicious. <laughs> I like taste it too. There it is, this beautiful snapper. So now I'm just going to cut some slits into it. Like that, on both sides. And then uh, we'll put the ingredients in. Alright, now we're going to put some slits into it. <laughs> Nice and deep. Is this eating the tail too? Yeah, we're gonna eat the tail too. Ooh. Stop. May let go you cut away goats. Egg and may go you be careful with that mice. Yeah, it's a really sharp knife. You always have to be careful with a knife. Yeah, okay. Okay? Okay. Tell the people watching to be careful with the knife. Because? Yeah. yeah. Salt and pepper on both sides. So we put... Yep, salt and pepper on both sides. Put a bit of garlic in there. Garlic, yeah. And rosemary and thyme. Fresh herbs from our garden, yeah, Rahim? 
Yeah, from our garden. How cool is that? And fresh fish from the ocean. Is that pretty cool? How cool? And putting lemon on top. Yeah, and we're putting lemon on top. And, and, and onions. Putting, putting onions on top, lemon. Let's wrap the fish up because it's going to go in the oven. Now we're going to put it in the fridge for a little bit before we put it in the oven. Alright, so I've heated up the oil. Here's the garlic. I'm just going to fry that for a bit. And see nice and fried and crispy. That's it, you only need to fry them for a couple of seconds, they're nice and crispy. Now we're going to put them over the fish. We should be cooked to perfection now. It looks really good, Bob. It's just very hot. Ooh. Ah, look at that. Wish you guys could smell it. You want to smell it? Yeah. I will take it out. Now do it. Now the oil. Ooh. Oil? Noisy. Yeah, it's very noisy. Why? Because it's the oil splashing on it, Bob. Ew! Here, I boy, you ew! I boy is very His eye boy is very ill, according to Rahim. He wants to smell it because he's not going to eat it. Let's get his reaction. <laughs> How does it smell? Nothing. It smells good. Smell again. Very good. You're gonna eat some? You're gonna try some? I, I Are you gonna I try want some? Meat. You want meat, okay? He's not a fish eater, guys. But here we go, that's the final product. How good does it look? We kept it nice and simple and it looks beautiful. Bob, this yes, going yes, like chicken. It smells like chicken? Yeah. Yeah, that's how good Baba cook it. Alright guys. Thanks for watching. I this hope you guys crazy. This is crazy, yes. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, Bye. and subscribe to the channel. Cheers, guys. Bye. Say bye. Bye.